It's almost 12.20 right now. I'm hungry. I'm gonna find something to eat. I think I'm gonna have some of my leftover veggie fried rice. It is so cool down here. What's the temperature? It's 54 degrees outside right now. 43, I lied, 43. I'm also gonna catch up on my favorite YouTuber. I haven't watched her latest videos, but that's her channel name. Alrighty, video is uploaded. It's 12.34 a.m. and we're gonna shut down for the night. All right, you guys, I'm gonna go to bed. So, I'll see you again when I wake up in the morning. Good morning, it's 11.41 right now on May 13th. I just got done texting my friend from work. She's a single mom. She works crazy hours. I was catching up and you know, asked her how she was doing. She said she was spending more time with her kids and she felt like she didn't really know them before all this. And they're young, they're, they're probably under 10 years old. She said that she felt like she didn't really know them before. She's getting to know her kids and now she knows her favorite her their her kids' favorite colors. And I just thought, how like how neat. If there's a silver lining and all this, people are starting to reconnect with, you know, their families and get to know each other and see habits and I just think that if we're gonna have a silver lining with this whole quarantine and COVID nineteen, that's gonna be one of them because I I know that Sam and I, our relationship, we it's gotten stronger, I feel like. We've learned, you know, habits and what we do and we've discovered we've discovered that I cuss. I start cussing a lot when food is really good and I didn't realize that and I was like, huh <laughs> I do do that. <laughs> um and just I don't know, I just thought it was really cool, so I just wanted to mention that. There is a silver lining. It's windy today and it feels cold again. I think it's 65 degrees today. See that tree? It's just like going all over the place. Phoebe, come on. Come on, Phoebe. Take your time, okay? <laughs> We're gonna have veggie burgers for lunch. I've never had a veggie burger that I know of at least. Well, no, I tried the Impossible Burger. It was good. We're gonna try these, though. I'm hoping it tastes good because I miss burgers. I have my veggie burger right here. I really want to like this. How come it's dark? I really want to like this. So I'm hoping that it's good. Sam's already taking a bite, and he made mmm sound. So hopefully it's good. taking a few bites the ketchup and the mustard help so if you want to try this I mean it's okay it doesn't taste exactly like a real burger but if I had my choice between this and the impossible burger I'd go with the impossible burger I have to be honest but the ketchup and the mustard help for a snack what we had yesterday and today is we bought some of this caramel dip you we found we find it in the like at walmart it's in the produce section those little islands that have like the you know they're there they have a light you know sugar-free version i think and they have the regular version so we buy this and then you just take some apples you slice them up and then you basically just dip it in there i'm sure other people have heard about this and people use it for different things but you just dip your apple in there and it's like a caramel apple it's really good and I'm sure there's nothing healthy about it, but there's no meat in it, so. Okay, honey, you ready for your next surprise? Sure. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Show us. Oh my gosh, so freaking crazy. Actually, it's kind of funny. <laughs> Can I have your autograph? <laughs> Where are we gonna put this one? That's up to you. Uh, 
I think we should put it on the outside of the front door. So this is where Sam, um, Jock Extraordinaire, lives. Dumb. I don't even <laughs> look like this anymore. That's even close. That's him right there. <laughs> right there. The lady, the girl in the white, he's right there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Can you sign it? Dumb. <laughs> I ordered some dry erase markers the other day ago and they came in today. They're, oh, they're magnetic, so. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Sam and I keep hearing stuff. I think our kitchen, like something goes on in our kitchen. Because from time to time, excuse the kind of cluttered counter, but from time to time, stuff will just like randomly shift in the dish rack and then just like what 30 minutes ago about 30 minutes ago the microwave just did well not that it made that that stopping sound like like that sound and then sometimes we hear like footsteps upstairs like right above us when we're down here in the living room it's weird. <laughs> and then a few weeks ago when there was a bunch of stuff right here, there was a basket of um, those poopy bags, those rolled up poopy bags. It just like flung off the counter. And Sam was over here and in the camera, you could see that it just went boop. And then sometimes, of course, Ben and Phoebe are like, they look up the stairs. They'll stand on the landing right there and they'll look up the stairs. It's weird. All right, so there was a change in the menu because today was supposed to be this baked cauliflower, the, <laughs> this baked cauliflower and yoki, but we got home late. We had to do some errands and we decided for today, tonight, to be leftover day. So these two are gonna be flip flopped. Okay, this is like maybe five minutes later from my last clip, but this light just flickered because I sat down here and I was texting really quick and then I could see the light flicker. Ooh, I'm gonna try this. I see people making this and buying it, so I'm wondering if it's good. It looks really good. Okay. Got a nice big spoonful. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's really good. Okay, you guys, it is 10:35, and I think I'm gonna go ahead and call it a night oh by the way i didn't have any meat today i'm really proud of myself tomorrow i'm going to bleach the counters and then i need to repot these plants i got these guys the other day ago and i need to repot them into better pots or bigger pots because i do want them to grow so anyway i'm gonna call it a night and i'll see you guys tomorrow thank you guys for watching good night